This is an instructional video on how to perform ECS, Electronic Calibration Service, on the InterScan 4000 series toxic gas monitor. To begin, open the instrument enclosure by removing the two screws located on the side of the instrument enclosure. Now, remove the sensor. Start by disconnecting the tubing first. Then, disconnect the lead wires. Now, remove the two screw screws located in the back of the instrument enclosure. Connect the negative lead of the digital voltmeter to ground. This is terminal G on the circuit board. Connect the positive lead of the digital voltmeter to S on the circuit board. Now go to the function switch located in the front of the instrument and turn the function switch to zero. Adjust the zero control upscale so that the digital voltmeter, not the analyzer, reads a number that is designated on your ECS certificate. For purposes of this demonstration, the digital voltmeter should read 800 millivolts. Adjust the span control so that the instrument digital display reads the value indicated on the ECS certificate. For the purposes of this demonstration, the instrument should read 1000. Rezero the instrument using the zero control. Install the newly calibrated sensor, which came with the ECS certificate that you are using, into the analyzer. Start by screwing the two screws back in to the back of the instrument. Then, reconnect the tubing. And finally, reconnect the lead wires. The instrument will temporarily go into alarm and this is a natural occurrence. You have now completed your ECS calibration. However, the analyzer is not yet ready for use. Please allow 24 hours for the newly replaced sensor to stabilize and then you can do your re-zero procedure as instructed in the instruction manual and you can use your instrument.